blood supply of the hand movie number two as we see here this is the inner artery the inner artery enters superficial to the flexor tenaculum outside the carpal tunnel and then at the level of the outer border at the level of the outer border of the thumb here in this level the inner artery when a curve make a curve and form an arch this arch this is the inner artery as you see here if you follow you will see the inner artery will uh, make an arch just once it enter the uh, wrist it give a deep branch it will give a deep branch which may be not can cannot be seen in this uh, model so the inner artery give deep branch and superficial branch the superficial branch which is the same continuation of the inner artery at the level of the outer border this is the outer border this is the uh, this is the sorry distal border and this is the proximal border at the level of the distal border of the thumb this is here is the this is surface anatomy this is the superficial palmar arch this we call it superficial palmar arch how can i know this superficial not deep palmar arch because we have two arches here superficial and deep once i am seeing the tendons so i am superficial don't forget that and once i am seeing the inner artery so this is a superficial palmar arch because the superficial palmar arch is a continuation of the ulnar artery while the deep palmar arch we cannot be see here is the continuation of the radial artery this is the radial artery so this ulnar artery as we said will curve after giving the deep branch it will curve to form the superficial palmar arch this artery con uh, uh, continued by a branch come this branch come from the radial artery this is the radial artery trunk and give this superficial branch and this is the radial artery continue so this branch what we call this name from its position this is superficial so we call it superficial palmar so we this is because palmar so this is superficial palmar a branch of the radial artery superficial palmar a branch of the radial artery this superficial palmar art branch of the radial artery will continue the curvature of the superficial palmar arch superficial palmar arch continued by superficial palmar branch from the radial artery to form a complete arch the deeper the radial artery here as we see this is the radial artery at the level of the uh, wrist or proximal to the wrist it will went this is anterior compartment just to still before reach the wrist it will went around the hand or around the wrist to enter a, a, a space here we call it the uh, snuff box this is the snuff box and this radial artery will go posterior to pass between the two heads of the uh, dorsal interossi this is the dorsal interossi will pass pierce here between the two head of the uh, dorsal interossi and pierce here 